This is an airlock puzzle. It was designed by Pete Kemgo from Singapore and made by Pelican in Czech Republic. The goal of this puzzle is to put all five parts inside the frame in such a way that there will be no sticking out parts and there will be no parts inside of this opening. So all five parts supposed to be within the frame. But as you can see, there is a restriction. You can't put the parts through these openings. They're too small to fit the parts. The only way to put all five parts inside the frame through this tiny opening. It is a new designer for Pelican. They never created puzzles by Pete Kiam go before, so I'm very excited to try this puzzle. If you like the airlock puzzle, I'll put a link where you can buy it in the video description. If you're lucky enough, it will be still available, but I have a feeling that this puzzle will be sold out very quickly. So now let's try to solve the puzzle. We have five parts. As you can see, you can actually put them inside the frame, but it seems like there is no way you can remove any of the parts since there is only one opening here if the parts are like that i won't be able to slide this piece down it is possible to put these large parts inside you just slide it in rotate a little bit and it is inside the frame and this piece as well even though the opening is only like two by one voxel but it is possible to fit such a large piece inside now i have to find a way how to assemble the parts inside the frame in such a way that I will be able to remove some of the parts. Like this one, I will be able to remove, I guess. Let's see. No, I won't be able to rotate it like that. So this is not the solution. What if I try this? Yeah, if I try like that, I will be able to remove this piece, but there is no chance I can remove any of these four parts. So that doesn't work. There are actually a lot of ways how you can assemble the parts inside the frame if there were no restrictions. But with the restriction, none of this solution will really work. Okay, maybe I can try something like that. And again, I'm blocking the parts in such a way that I won't be able to move them when I need to move them. Yeah, that's not the correct one either. This looks pretty interesting, but again, all the parts are blocked. I won't be able to remove this one. What if I do it like that? Still the same. What if I change something? No. It looks like it is totally impossible to do something here. This part, part won't be the last one to fit since it is too large and it requires a lot of space to rotate. So it will be one of the first, I guess. This one, maybe it will go here. Then one of these parts go here. Uh, no, that doesn't look like the solution either. Ah, uh, there is one piece that is kind of extra. If I remove it, I will be able to solve the puzzle. But I still have to find a way how to fit all five parts inside. Yeah, this will work, but this part will be inside of this opening, which is not allowed. All parts are supposed to be within the frame. Okay, I'll keep looking. Okay, that is interesting. Let's see what I can do here. This piece slides down. At least I have a movement here. That is good. I can move this. <gasps> and I can probably, if there is enough space, remove this part. What will be the next one? Maybe I will be able to... No, I don't think so. Oh, but if I put it here... I will be able to rotate this part. Oh, okay. That looks like the solution. Let's try. I'll put this one right here. This piece goes here. Then this one, I have to rotate almost all the parts. Okay, the next one is this piece. Yeah, I can fit it like that. This goes down. Oh, I guess 
I found the correct solution. Let's see. The last piece, I can easily fit it inside. And the puzzle is solved. Oh, okay. That was a very nice trick. And all the parts are inside the frame. Okay, I love this puzzle. Not too hard, but very satisfying. This is a very nice and interesting uh, trick to put parts inside. If you like the airlock puzzle, link will be in the video description. Thank you for watching the video. See you in my next one.